On the night of June 20th, 1791, Louis and his immediate family, disguised as servants, left Paris. They traveled as far as Varennes on their way to Metz. At Varennes, the king was recognized and his flight was halted. On June 24th, a company of soldiers escorted the royal family back to Paris. The power that was once in your hand is now gone. I know, I know. We don't have time for that. The riots have been getting worse with the kids. We can't stay here. We're completely out of time. You think you're gonna rule? Nobody's looking up to you anymore. We're leaving tonight. Get yourself and the children ready. What's the problem, miss? I've gotta pee. The leaders of the National Constituent Assembly, determined to save the constitutional monarchy, announced the king had been abducted from the capital. Such a convenient public fiction could not cloak the realities that the chief counter-revolutionary in France now sat on the throne and the constitutional monarchy might not last long. I hope this works. To us it would be fine. He got there really fast. Can I see her? Sure. You're the king. Uh, yeah. What's going on? No. Hey, come here. He's the king. What are you doing? Go! Go! What? I got this. I can't promise anything. <laughs> Spider Man, Spider Man. <laughs> I've got to pee. <laughs> On the night of June 20th, 1791, Louis and his immediate family, disguised as servants, left Paris. They traveled as far as Varennes on their way to Metz. <laughs>